Hey, Sappington Elementary. My name is Lisa Hale. I'm the owner of Z Total Body Fitness, a boutique fitness center in Fenton, Missouri. I have done a lot with the uh, Lindbergh uh, School District and Sappington especially. I've done some morning workouts for some families. I've done, oh, I think we've launched some book clubs and things like that. So uh, I was excited when Coach Mary asked me if I would do a plank challenge. So I hear you're doing a plank challenge, so that's awesome. So uh, I love planks, but I like to do a lot of different versions of planks. So everybody, when they hear a plank, they think that's all you're gonna do is be on your hands, and a lot of people can't, so you can be on your elbows. A lot of people can't be on their um, toes, so you can be on your knees. So I'm gonna show you some options. But uh, we're gonna do some different things and then uh, hopefully give you a little bit of a challenge and uh, you can uh, do this uh, on your uh, free time during the holidays, right? So anyway, all right, so let's get going. So I always like to make sure people know how to do a plank properly. So I put my hands wide, hands under shoulders, okay? So that's where your strength is. Don't think it's back here or forward, all right? So I'm gonna dig my toes into the ground, okay? I'm gonna come up, my abs are gonna be in, my head, neck is lined up with the spine, all right? If that's too much for you, I tell people always get in the hand plank, toe plank, and then if you needed to drop your knees, your knees are in uh, back. Your body is in slant, so you can still get into a nice uh, plank, okay? This isn't a plank when your uh, knees are underneath your hips, all right? So we'll start out nice and slow with the plank, all right? I like to, I'm just giving you some tips. I like to spread my toes out a little wider, okay? So I have my toes out like I call it an X, okay? So now in this plank, I'm going to do some rows, all right? This is how you get that upper body strength moving. You gotta pull those abs in. You gotta keep those hips still, all right? Got a little background music if you can hear it. It's always good to work out with music, it helps you. All right, so hold into that. If you need a break, you break and you get back up, right? All right, now I'm going to go where I reach my hand out. Reach my hand out. Eyes are down, don't drop your head. All right, eyes are down, crown of the head is forward. So again, I'm toes in the ground, my legs are out wide. Okay, because that's what I choose. All right, plus I've been doing this for 30 something years. So, you're just starting out with a plank. That's good, you get used to it. You find your way, you find which one you like. Good, all right, we're holding right here. So now I'm gonna take those hands, let me move here for you. All right, so now I'm gonna take the hands and I'm just taking my hands outside. So once my arms are underneath my shoulders, that's, you know, obviously that's my base. That's where my strength is. Once I move them out, boy, your abs know that you're taking your hand from uh, away from the strength spot, right? Touch, 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 touch. And last one right here. If you needed to take a break, you drop your feet down, quick break, come back. So now I'm just gonna pedal the knees. We're gonna get a lot done in this challenge. All right, so we got a few more minutes. All right, we're just gonna pedal the knees. Pedal the knees. Now we're gonna pedal the knees. Actually, we're gonna drop them. We're gonna bring them down and up, down and up, down and up. I just lightly hit the floor and I come back up. Again, my eyes are down, my head isn't dropped, and I'm strong through the arms. Boy, you'll feel this. When you do this drop and lift, same time, man, you feel it. Three, give me more. Two, last one, good. Hold that plank, good. One of my favorite ones is, I call it tappy tappy. Tap, tap, tappy tappy. All right, so again, trying that. A lot of people like to rock, okay? That's not working, okay? Hands under shoulders, tap, tap. Again, eyes down, crown of the head forward. Yes, I repeat myself because many times, you're not hearing it the first, second, third, fourth time, so I repeat it nonstop. Tappy, tappy, tappy. Keeping those abs in, keeping those hips still as possible. Tappy, tappy, tappy and hold. Next challenge on this, if you can. Again, if you had to be on your knees, all right, Where's my knees? Right there. I drop my hands, 
I'm on my toes and I drop. So you can be tapping right here. All right, so you can always do something on the knees as well. Just what we were doing earlier, everything can be done on the knees. And that's a good way to start, okay? If you need to break, oh, a good, nice stretch back. Feels good? Come back into it. Okay, next thing we're gonna do. Let me, now that I'm further away from the camera, you can see me. All right, so here. So my toes are next. I'm gonna tap the side of my leg. So again, I'm now on one arm. One arm plank, I'm just slapping the side of my leg. All right, uh, I, can, I can give you plank ideas all day long. I'm full of it, full of planks. Come on, do more. Side, 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 last one. Good, drop the knees, pull back. Woo, feeling that. All right, so some of my favorite work is side planks. All right, got a few more minutes. All right, so again, I'm giving you a bunch of options. Maybe there's some days you wanna take one of those options and try to get up to 30 seconds and maybe up to a minute and keep working your way up and master that one. Maybe you kind of like what I'm doing now is just a real mix uh, and that's okay too. So again, you, you gotta find, you gotta do something and you gotta find your way um, of, of plank challenges and, it, and they're amazing, okay? All right, so last thing we're gonna do is like some side planks. All right, so my elbow is under my shoulder. All right, never out here, that's gonna kill your shoulder. Elbow underneath the shoulder. My legs are stacked, all right? This arm is gonna go up. Remember, the hip is up on top. You're not rolled back on your, on your backside. Lift up, all right? Abs are in. I'm just gonna take that hip off the floor and reach the arm of the head. And I'm gonna come down to the legs. And I'm gonna reach, and I'm gonna come down. And I'm gonna reach, and I'm gonna show you options here. So this is a good basic, okay? If I wanna take that leg up, all right? The top leg stays up then that's what I do, all right? If I want to take both legs up, I would extend the leg out, all right? And so now my legs are stacked and I'm lifting that hip off the ground and dropping, all right? So that was a couple of options I just gave you. All right, so let's go to the other side. Almost done, almost done. Where's the elbow? Under the shoulder, always. All right, elbow under the shoulder, strong. Keep the ear up, don't have the ear down, ear up. All right, work the sides, legs are stacked, arm is up. So we're just gonna lift, all right? So my legs are stacked. I'm just lifting, put the weight on the knee, pull the abs in, hip is up, all right? I'm gonna add that leg. I'm gonna lift that leg up on top there, and I'm gonna lift. And then I can move that arm, okay, I can move that arm. If you don't wanna have the arm up, you can be right here, all right? So you can be right here. And then I'm going to stack both legs straight, and I'm lift and drop. 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 All right, the last thing on the list. You're gonna love this, or you're gonna hate it. But a lot of times we hate it and love hate relationship. All right, so I'm gonna go elbows on this one. All right, I'm going elbows on this one. All right, and now I'm gonna take my hips side to side. So feet together. I'm rolling side to side. You can just go a little bit, like a little rock with the hips. See how that works, the abs, a little twist, twist, like a washing machine. Or you can take it down, side to side. All right, so then always stretch out of that. You can relax the toes, put the hands on the ground, lift up. You can draw your hands back and press back into that stretch. All right, because if you did, a lot, of, a lot of planks, you want to stretch out afterwards. So that feels good, right? Awesome. Well, Sappington, thank you for giving me the opportunity to uh, be able to show you some planks that I like to uh, do. And uh, again, thank you, everybody. Bye. Plank away. Look what it does to your hair. But it's good for your abs. See ya.